582 trips on the Turtle platform, over 20 vehicles out here in Las Vegas as a power host, been at it the last 10 months. I'm gonna teach you guys three things that you need to run a super successful Turtle business. Let's tap in. One is you need a reliable vehicle a reliable vehicle, not one that has issues after every other rent, rent rental, okay? Because there's gonna be guests that they're gonna leave reviews because of their rental experience. So you want a reliable vehicle. Trust me, it's gonna make it easier. Don't go for those vehicles that break down. You know, it's funny, my dad, he's a mechanic, and he's like, never get a Ford, RC, never get a Ford. I said, why? He said, it stands for found on road dead. I said, all right, I'm good. My dad's a mechanic, but he doesn't really help with like the whole scaling day to day, but he, he does work on cars and he's worked on my personal car so many times. What I'm saying is get a reliable car. I think about the Hondas, the Mazdas. I think about things where it's easy to get parts for. I like Corollas, right? Toyota's a good brand. I also like Nissans. We have four Nissans on the fleet, two Nissan Sentras and two Nissan Versa. So we have a total of four. Get stuff where you can get parts easily. They're everywhere. Go to the junkyard, get something quick. Get a vehicle that's easily repairable so that you don't have any headaches and it lasts for a long time on long drives as well. Like for example, a lot of the guests, they go for long drives, it just happens, okay? People love to really maximize their minimum 200 miles a day. So make sure you get a reliable car to be able to place and rent on the Turtle platform. Number two, you want an in-house reliable mechanic. It doesn't have to be in-house, but I've seen a lot of the successful Turtle hosts out there. They either know about cars, know how to do the basics, foundations about cars, they got a homie that hooks them up, or they're really cool with a local body shop that can do quick turnarounds and can actually tell you what's wrong and not upsell you or upcharge you on all the other little things that's unnecessary. You want a reliable mechanic. I know a lot of people quit this platform because they don't want to know touch cars, they don't know anything about cars, and it just gives them headaches. Trust me, there's going to be times where there's going to be guests that have issues, and if you have no idea about cars, you don't have a phone call away to ask somebody to diagnose it, it's going to be pretty stressful. Okay, one time we had one of the guests, their battery died, and if you don't know how to change a battery, you're done, son. <laughs> so make sure you have at least some knowledge, personally, or a connection. But don't let it stop you. I mean, go through it, go in the trenches. Yes, there's gonna be times, this is business, where you're gonna have your ups and downs, okay? But really, if you have knowledge as a mechanic or know somebody that's a mechanic that can help, that's a phone call away, can help you diagnose these problems, it will make it so much simpler and a lot easier to scale this business. Have an in-house mechanic, which we do, or a local body shop, maybe a mom and pop shop, that will hook you up, be real with you, be truthful, and earn your business for the long term. Make sure you have a trustworthy, reliable mechanic that you can chat with. Number three, which is the last one, is you want a tracker. Trust me, you want a tracker, okay? When you are getting out there on the Turtle platform, there's gonna be times where, you know, and you don't wanna be like, once you get your tracker, you're always watching your cars. Trust me, I was doing this for a couple weeks where I was going, looking at where every single car was. Eventually, you become numb to it. It doesn't matter as long as you know that your tracker's there. Now, there's been some questions with people saying, I want my tracker hidden versus a tracker that's on the ODB. So. What, whatever you guys want, okay? Whatever you guys want. I have a tracking company. If you guys want to, to get that recommendation, type in, in the comments, type in what your Instagram is, and then DM me on Instagram, okay? DM me on Instagram and then tap in below, comment below what your Instagram, but these are only for the people that are gonna scale their fleet, that have three, five vehicles, or you're looking to eventually get to three to five vehicles. This has been the Better Tracking Company. I'm really cool with the rep. Send me your email in the DMs and then I'll send you that information. Trackers are just so much easier, saves time, peace of mind. A renter's gonna tell you, oh yeah, hey, I'm only five minutes down. They lying, they're 40 minutes out there. They're they're just trying to give you peace of mind and you're not trying to just wait on them. Those of you that don't do contactless drop-offs, check-ins, check-outs, okay? So I just say trackers are definitely the thing. You want a tracker, helps helps you a lot. It's gonna be worth it. It's worth the expenses each month and it just really helps you guys both. We've got a lot of people that have lost claims. They tried to lie to us, tell us they didn't run things over, they didn't hit stuff, and we literally have it on camera from our tracker. So we've won a lot of claims, made a lot of money because there's a lot of people that lie. 
It's just the world. The world is wicked. The world is evil. You know what I mean? So get a tracker. It'll save you a lot, especially if you have one with a camera. There's people that just like hidden trackers just to know where their cars are at. That's fine. I actually won way more and I've made way more, much, much more money having a tracker that records everything so that we're able to legit win our claims with these people that are straight up lying, telling us they didn't hit it. And they're trying to tell us that we're the ones that vandalize or whatever. And again, I'm a very honest business person, okay? We gotta be honest as hosts and just as people. It's just literally good people practice. But there's, like I said, there's a lot of evil people. We're out here in Las Vegas. So yeah, we get a lot of interesting people out here gambling, doing a lot of hoo-hahs. So trackers is definitely something you need to create a long-term successful business. Hope y'all enjoyed. Tap in if you guys enjoy this stuff. I just did a video on a day in the life. Day in the life. You guys wanna see what it takes to really do a 20 plus car fleet. We did eight check-ins, checkouts that day and I'm just kinda showing you guys vibing. So if you guys enjoy that stuff, it'll make a lot, a lot of sense on what a day in the life is as a Turo Power host. Tap in. Y'all be blessed. Have a great week. Bye-bye.